Welcome to the Matriarchal Facilitator. I have a word for you on today. That word is smooth speech. Let's pray. Father God, we come before your throne of grace and mercy, Lord God. Just saying thank you, O Lord. Lord, protect us from those, Lord God, who have smooth speech, Lord God. Everything with their words seems right. Everything that they speak seems right, Lord God. But that there is a hidden agenda behind those words, Lord God. Lord, we just thank you right now, Lord God, for knowledge and wisdom and understanding, Lord God. Lead us, O oh Lord, in the right way to go. Lord, we pray for families all over the world right now, Lord God. Heal hearts, Lord God. Set minds free, Lord God, in Jesus' name. Father God, I submit myself unto you. Use me, O Lord, have your way. And it's in your son Jesus' name I do pray. Amen. Smooth speech. We have scripture references. Psalms 55, 20 through 21. My former companion attacked his friend. He broke his promises. His words were smoother than cream, but there was hatred in his heart. His words were as soothing as oil, but they cut like sharp swords. Psalms 55 and 22. Leave your troubles with the Lord and he will defend you. He never lets honest people be defeated. That's the word of the Lord. So what I got from this message is, even though that smooth speech was meant to distract you and to take you out of alignment with the Lord, do not worry about that. The Lord will handle those individuals. Remember, it is he who defends you. Do not avenge yourselves. Yes, they believe that their words can have power, can hold power. But those very same words will be used to destroy them. So you let those people believe that they're getting away with whatever they're getting away with. And we know that it's an entity inside of those people that are using them. And so also I would ask you today to pray as well for those individuals why because they need prayer they have been taken captive by the enemy and their minds are not their own they are allowing the enemy to use them to get their message across remember you don't take anything into your own hands let the lord fight and defend you with honor with honor <laughs> with honor i'm telling you who he will do it i'm telling you he'll do it but with honor allow god to do it for you do not take your own vengeance into your own hands and bind your own self up don't do it in jesus name because that's all they want. If they can get you to themselves, let's not even think about that. Scratch that. Forget that part. So let's just trust the Lord, period, point blank, to get us to where we need to go in Jesus' name. Anyway, on today, I'm sending you love, light. I pray that on today you know that Jesus loves you. And so do I. Be blessed.